Greetings and welcome to another episode of Trippy Food and another installment of Snack Attack. We are once again joined by the infamous <laughs> Katie Freeman of Beyond Seattle Eats. Welcome, Katie. Always good to work with you. Thank you, thank you. Not sure what I'm infamous for, but I'll take it. Uh, eating more hot dogs than I could probably eat in like one day. How's that? Fair enough. Um, so today we're going to try something, uh, you, you were pretty excited about this because it has like everything that you love in it, right? As opposed to me, that it has like everything that I don't love in it. But again, I'm keeping an open mind about it. And the thing is, is like, um, uh, I almost kind of get tired of Oreos just because like they'll come out with a different flavor and you're like, yeah, it's okay. Yeah, it's okay. That's okay. But these actually sounded pretty good. These actually sounded pretty good. So we are trying the limited edition salted caramel brownie oreos yeah and um and so the thing that's odd about this is um it well they specifically say salted caramel brownie flavor cream so they want to tell you that it don't expect the cookie to taste like it it's just the flavor cream that tastes like it and then underneath it it says artificially flavored so like oh, why would you art why would you need to artificially flavor those things i mean like you know caramel is just sugar Right? And um, I guess maybe part of the brownie? Maybe like, I don't know. I'm not sure. And then and then specifically, I love this. I love this, and, you know, a little word balloon that says, topped with salt. So they actually yeah. put salt on the on the cookie. So maybe there's no salt on the inside. Maybe the salt is on the cookie. Yeah. So I assume that you are excited about trying this. Uh, they have like the uh, caloric in in intake down below. I'm not even gonna pay attention to that because, you know, otherwise I should stop doing this. I'm going to start paying attention to how many calories I'm, I'm, I'm doing. Um, so um, before we start, any any comments from you um, on this before we start? You know, what's your excitement level on that? What's your, you know? Yeah, I love an Oreo. Uh, like you mentioned, the artificial flavoring. I think that's because all Oreos are vegan. A lot of people don't know that. Oh, so, oh that's right, because they don't use cream anymore. Right. So the caramel, caramel is usually butter and sugar. So I think they have to put that artificial butter flavoring in. Oh, okay. Does it say it's vegan though? Um, I, don't, I, I didn't see anything that says it's say vegan. It. But yeah, nope. if you look at these ingredients, it says it contains wheat and soy. And so they would tell you if there was dairy. But yeah, all Oreos are vegan. Yeah, I, I had heard something like that. And I don't see anything here that, uh, that would indicate that it has any uh, contains wheat soy you know that's that's it yeah. so it sounds like it's uh, it's pretty much vegan yeah like uh, uh, the brownies would not would not be typically uh, vegan things right no have you have you gone vegan on us I haven't but <laughs> sometimes I do during Lent which is why I oh that. really oh, okay yeah. I eat vegan but you know I eat everything so I eat vegan I and other stuff so yeah that's pretty good all right so you ready yes let's grab one of these Oh, they've got it's a dual filling. Do oh really? Yeah. It's oh yeah, two different colors. Filling. That's right. But yeah, look at there that. There is a brownie layer. It looks like in the caramel layer. Yep. Or the artificially flavored brownie layer and the car uh, caramel layer. Correct. Now, do you do the, you know, the thing where you, you just eat the I whole thing? I eat the whole cookie together. Let's do it. You ready? Okay. Cheers. I was afraid that the outside was going to be really salty because they put salt on the outside. Mm -hmm. but it's not too salty. No, I am going to pull it apart. When I do a review of Oreos, I do like to taste the filling on its own. Well, we could have started with that. Let me take a look at that. Ooh, that's interesting. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Look at this. <laughs> You're gonna feel it apart?
Yeah, there's no salt on the inside. No. Or I there's no there. there's no extra salt on the inside. Right. It's just on the exterior of the cookie. Yeah. Are you getting fudge brownie taste though? Mm-mm. I mean, the caramel is easy, easy enough to do. It's just sugar, right? Right. But I'm not really getting fudge brownie taste. It's chocolatey. You know, it's, I'm getting ch a, a chocolate taste. Mm -hmm. I'm getting a cocoa taste. Mm -hmm. But I can't really say like fudge, I can't really say like fudge brownie taste. Yeah, I think they might have missed the mark on this one. Like, like, I don't know, maybe if you get like more of one part or the other, but I mean, it's not bad. It's sweet. Mm -hmm. You know, it's as you would expect it. it. Everything in there has, it just screams sugar. It's sweet, but I don't, I'm not really getting that, um, I'm not really getting salted caramel, caramel brownie flavor. But again, you know, like, I guess it would have eggs in it probably, right? Like a brownie. Brownie, brownie would have eggs good. in it. Yeah. Brownie would have mm -hmm. milk milk in it, maybe. Right. Eggs and milk. Right. Yeah. And and maybe but like you said, butter. And mm -hmm. maybe that's maybe that's what's missing. Yeah, maybe. I think they they had another brownie flavored Oreo and it didn't really taste like brownie either. It just tasted like chocolate. Yeah. yeah. I think well the other part is that is that the um, the flavor cream is really creamy. And mm -hmm. you would expect that if it's going to be brownie, there's going to be a little bit of, you know, maybe Some puffiness to it. it. Yeah, I would think, you know, that would mm -hmm. that'd be just me. So again, it, it's not terrible. Like I've had um, Oreos that tape that to me di didn't have as good a taste as this. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, do they deliver on making a salted caramel brownie flavored Oreo? I don't think so. No, no, it's a good Oreo. I'm, I'm going to eat these. They're not going to go to waste, but yeah. Um, I think as far as like their specialty flavors, it missed the mark. So would you say thumbs up, thumbs in the middle, thumbs down? Probably not a thumbs down, right? But yeah, thumbs, thumbs in the middle or thumbs up? Thumbs in the middle because it's an Oreo. It's a tasty Oreo. Um, but but is it something special that I would buy again? Probably not. Yeah, again, I think uh, uh, they missed the mark on the whole salted ca caramel brown. There's some nice flavor to it. Mm -hmm. But it, but is it salted caramel brownie flavor? Maybe not so much. Yeah. Not so really. so for me, thumbs in the middle as well because it it doesn't suck, right? <laughs> it doesn't not suck, bad. but it's you know it's a it's a, it's an okay Oreo, right? Right. Right. Yeah. So thumbs in the middle for me as well. Well, okay. uh, Katie, we have some other things planned, uh, but as always, thank you for joining us. At, uh, we we value your opinion, um, especially yeah. being a salted caramel brownie lover, as you are. <laughs> Uh, so if you decide that you're going to go out and get these and try, maybe you'll get a better, um, I mean, a different uh, experience than than Katie and I had. So, uh, but if you go out, go out and want to try that, just be careful out there because it's crazy out there. So please be careful. Please take care of yourselves. Please take care of others. And we'll see you soon. Bye. Yeah. Thanks for checking out Trippy Food. If you enjoyed watching that video half as much as I did making it, well then I enjoyed it twice as much as you did. And if that's the case, you'll probably like this video right here. And if not, check out this video right here. That one's a little bit different. Either way, leave a comment down below. And be sure to subscribe by clicking on the Trippy Food icon right here. Glad you could make it, and we hope to see you again soon.